Breaking story for February the 15th, 2016. Here's the headline. I want you to listen to me very carefully now, and I want you to understand what's really going on here. Here's the headline. I'll provide the link below. Scalia found dead with pillow over his head. Now, what has come out now is that the bed he was found in, that he slept in, was basically in perfect condition untouched the sheets not moved out of place uh, the, the the covers not wrinkled as someone would sleep and he was found with a pillow over his head now red flag red flag why do the red flags not pop up people something is not right here there was no 911 call 911, the police never arrived on the scene. First, it comes out that he died in a sleep from a heart attack. Now, it's natural causes. And again, no medical examiner, no police on scene. This is unheard of. And what's even more unheard of, there will be no autopsy and of course Barack Obama is rushing now to replace him and a lot of things are not adding up with us let me bring you this article I don't always agree with a lot of people I don't always agree with Alex Jones but he put a video out and it's his gut feeling and it's mine that Scalia was murdered they have to have to bring someone in now and that's what they're gonna do because this Supreme Court Justice Antonin Scalia was for the Second Amendment the right to bear arms he was for our freedoms and he fought for the Constitution he was in the way Justice uh, Antonin uh, Scalia was found dead in his resort hotel room at uh, Kibolo Creek uh, Ranch on Saturday. Questions have been flying about the immediate uh, declaration of natural causes as the means of death. I'm reading from the article here. According to the ranch owner, Scalia was described as uh, animated and engaged during dinner Friday night. He was one of three dozen invite invitees rather to an event unrelated to law or politics. Yet just hours later, after missing both breakfast and lunch, he was found dead of apparent natural causes. Later, media outlets reported he had suffered a heart attack. Uh, related, here's another story, that you'll have the link to this. Urgent calls begin for uh, Scalia autopsy. Democrats fundraise off Scalia's death. Houston businessman John Poindexter, who owns the 30,000-acre luxury ranch, told the San Antonio Express News he was seated near me and I had a chance to observe him. He was very entertaining. But about 9 p.m., he said, it's been a long day and a long week. I'm going to get some sleep. Poindexter knocked on the Scalia's door about 8.30 the next morning. Listen to me now. The door was locked and the judge did not answer. Three hours later... Poindexter returned from an out, uh, outing and determined Scalia was still missing. Let me ask you this, and this is what they're asking in this article. It's from World Net Daily. What do you think? Should an autopsy be performed on Scalia? Yes. Yes, but it's not going to ever happen. You can't autop someone, autopsy, perform an autopsy on a person that was murdered. Depends on who the murderers are. We discovered uh, the judge in bed, a pillow, a pillow over his head. I don't think I even need, need to read on. His bedclothes were unwrinkled, said Poindexter. I don't know about you, but maybe I do. But when I get up in the morning, if I get up in the middle of the night, my pillow, the pillowcase is half off of the pillow or the pillow's on the floor. The, the bed sheet is off of the bed, all wrinkled. And uh, I don't think I sleep too much differently than anyone else. Who falls asleep with their arms folded, the bed immaculate, untouched, and, and sleeps with a pillow over their face? He was lying very restfully. Yeah, 
It looked like he had not uh, quite awakened from a nap, he said. His hands were sort of almost folded on top of the sheets. Come on! Folded on top of the sheets. The sheets weren't rumpled up at all. Scalia did not have a pulse and his body was cold, and after consulting with a doctor at a hospital in Alpine, Poindexter concluded resuscitation would have been uh, futile. Call a doctor! And Alpine, why didn't you call 911? Where were the police? I thought that was the law. But when someone passes away, whether it's at, uh, in your home, when my wife's mother passed away in her home, the police came, the paramedics came. There were no paramedics here. No police officers on scene. Uh, ultimately, they became a... Oh, let me. He then uh, contacted federal authorities. At federal authorities, not 911, no EMS. At first, encountering a series of answering services because he was calling on a weekend. Well, why don't you call 911? There's a cover up here. I really believe this man was murdered for the elite's agenda. And the agenda of this evil, evil darkness that has fallen over this world. The takeover of America, the takeover of the world. I, I'm going to put the link to this below. I mean, there's a, there's quite a bit more, but I think I've covered the gist of this. Something is very wrong here. Uh, Scalia found dead with pillow over his head. I don't think I need to say any more. Pray. Pray, everyone. Pray without ceasing. Subscribe to my channel. Leave me comments.